do a couple of things. Um, you know, first of all, I figure out I figure out what everyone's got to figure out, and that's just, how do you break it up into manageable chunks? How do you find something that you can measure? And the second thing I do is I look at value. So just you know, what's the purpose of, of spending that time? So for me, because I've got multiple ventures and multiple interests, I use what we call a pyramid model. And so I think of this, this pyramid as being either sharp and tall or very flat at times. And it goes in chapters of my life. So at the top of the pyramid, you might rule off and say that the, the top part, which is 40% of the mass of the pyramid, is my current focus, where I'm going to be spending all my energy. Now I work 80, 90 hours a week. I'm addicted to my work. I love what I do. That's like a full-time job. And then under that, I might have 10%, and it's another level of the pyramid. Um, and then under that, I might have 2 or 3%. And it allows me, when I take a snapshot, I say to myself, well, what do I do with that 80, 90 hours? What does that pyramid look like? And over time, that will change. And I still have patterns of those pyramids over the last few years. And it's, for me, an important way to make sure I balance my overall aggregate time. And then there are other things, you know, we all use calendars, we all chop up time. Uh, I try to be very focused about my meetings, how I want to have my meetings. Uh, I try uh, to make the right kind of decisions at the right time with the right amount of people. I think about the choice of that group uh, because I like consensus-based decision making, but I'm always aware of time.